Hey guys, what's up? It's Robo here, Robo347 that is, and uh, we're back in Minecraft. We're playing Stranded Minecraft again, my survival series where we uh, end up on a deserted island and we have to survive. It's been quite a while since I recorded one of these videos, but uh, I got quite a nice response from the first one. Got more than my sort of my low bar, I set a bar for all my videos, and if I get at least that, then uh, you know, I'd like to continue the series. Um, so I hit that, and I had a lot of fun recording the first episode. I had a lot of fun prepping for the next four episodes. So I, I did some prep work for the next four episodes, like I just mentioned. Um, <clears throat> so I'm going to hopefully record all four tonight. Maybe I'll just get two done, but definitely going to see some more in this series. And I've already started planning my next series. Um, anyway, so before we go have a look at that work, we're just going to come back here, and we're going to have a look at this spawn chest. Uh, if you remember from last episode, I said, uh, go try and treat this spawn chest as like stuff that washes up on shore. Um, so yeah, and I also found out that you do need to actually delete the chest, break the chest, in order for it to respawn. So uh, let's check what we've got this time. Ooh, not bad. Some food, that's definitely good. Um, got some stuff planned for this episode regarding food. Some wood, that's always good. Uh, these wood tools are pretty much useless, but I will take these saplings. We'll just break that quickly and let everything else despawn, but uh, we'll carry the rest back with us. Uh, so how have you guys been? I've been good. I've been spending a lot of time working out on my channel. Um, stuff like that. I've done quite a bit, as you can probably see already. I've done quite a bit on our little spawn island. Um, and I hope you enjoy it. Now what we're going to do today is we're going to work on getting a farm sort of set up sorted. And we're also, we've recently had an update in Minecraft where it's added some new blocks. So we're going to make some little changes to our little surf shack here. Just have to slow down so I don't break my boat. Give you a little tour before we start all that though. So like I said, oh no, no! Ah. Like I've said, we've, I've uh, done quite a little bit in this little island here. So uh, I put up some of these uh, topiary bushes, haven't done much inside, I'll show you that in a second. Um, so I added these, these uh, paths everywhere, the boardwalks, put these torches down, this is what I'm going to be using for lighting, mostly on my island. Done quite a few paths already, um, I did set up a little farming section here, um, I haven't actually put in any of the farms or anything, we'll get to that in a minute, there's something down there I'll show you in a little bit, like I said quick tour and then we'll get straight into it. Um, if you follow the path this way, the, the path gets quite jagged and oh, there's some zombie flesh there. Stuff along the coast right here and it leads to my quarry where I've been mining sand and sandstone and other such materials and this quarry is going to extend quite a bit. I'll see if I can uh, see, yeah, this is sort of the outline I've had, I've got for the quarry. Gather sand and sandstone for my builds. It's quite a big section. Planted some trees along here, lots of sandstone use, lots of spruce wood. Added the Mojang uh, 4J Studios, whatever. The Minecraft people added um, different uh, cover colored wood uh, fences and fence gates and stuff, so I made uh, this sort uh, of spruce following our theme. Um, this way we've got another sort of like coastal path um, which will eventually lead up here to our oasis and uh, other such building areas. Lots of zombie flesh everywhere. We're gonna have lots of... Ooh, some bones. We need them. Um, more zombie flesh down here. And this section down here will be our little beach resort. Um, see more of that in a couple episodes. Um, but what we're going to get done today is, we, like I said, we're going to make the necessary changes to this uh, our little surf shack here. And um, we are also going to get our farm started up here. So just let me go put some of this stuff away. Um, I've, Like I said, I did some prep work. Um, beach Bar and Resort. I've got planned for episode 4, maybe episode 5. If not, I'll start the Oasis. Episode 3, there's a little hint about what you should uh, expect for episode 3. And episode 2, which is this episode, you can see got quite a few materials here. I'm just going to store a couple of things, plant a couple of them as well. Alright, uh, let's go inside. 
So like I said, I haven't changed much in here. Um, mostly working on the stuff outside. I'm going to leave the apples here too. I might make... I might have use for golden apples later. Not that I have any gold, I don't think. Some of this stuff away. Zombie flesh. Might actually keep the zombie flesh on us. We're going to eat that. So yeah, I haven't changed anything in here yet. Just yet, that's what we're going to do. Start of this episode. And get a nice little look of what our, our, our little deserted island has become so far. Right, so let's head down, let's get started this episode. Um, so what, what are we going to do? First part of this episode, we're going to redecorate our house with the new stuff. So I've got some uh, spruce wood fence, some green cactus dye, some green glass, and uh, three spruce doors. What could we be doing with this, I wonder? First of all, let's replace this first door with one of the uh, new doors that they added. Now every time, depending on what kind of materials you use, changes the looks of the doors. I think that looks really quite nice. I've got, as you can see, I've got some spruce wood fences here. Let's open her up. Let's go inside. Uh, what's next? Uh, let's do the glass next. Um, also, another thing they added is you can now switch between traditional, as in PC Minecraft, and um, where is it? Classic crafting and uh, the Xbox Easy crafting. Uh, because I'm, I know the recipes already, and, and I think it. Uh, I, I've played Minecraft on the PC before. I much rather this crafting style, <clears throat> if I can remember it. I actually don't remember how to make stained glass paint, so <laughs> this will be interesting. Um, let's see, first of all, I think it's... I think I can make paints first. Let's try. Completely just like, screwed myself over just there. No, okay. Well, we just wasted a bunch of glass, but that's okay. We'll, uh... Handle that another time. <clears throat> should be. Should have enough here? No. Okay. Um. Well, I might uh, cook up a little bit of glass while we're waiting. Yeah, I have quite a bit of sand here. So, I've got half the stack. Coal, that's okay. We will get some. So much for prepping this episode. <clears throat> uh, we need four more pieces of glass right now. Yeah. So much for saying that I knew all the recipes and then backtracking immediately. I had some glass in there. Yeah, there we go. Uh, let's go place these other doors while we're waiting. So up here. Let's break this one very slowly. How do we have it? We have an inset, so place it like that. <clears throat> Sorry if this audio is a little quiet, guys. Still working on uh, my microphone and all that stuff. Yeah, let's see how that looks. Yeah, that looks very nice. Uh, they also recently just added, they've added two updates since. Uh, when we last had a video, but yeah, they also added uh, dark wood and acacia wood items into the creative crafting menu. They're not quite in, you know, survival just yet, but uh, holding out hope for that. I mean, very short. Should have enough glass. Yeah. Okay. Let's make some green panes. I wanted cyan or blue, but I don't have any lapis, so green will do for now. If we get some lapis, we'll uh, go from there. I think this is how you make it. Yeah, sweet. I don't know if 32 will be enough, actually. <laughs> Hopefully it is. <clears throat> One, two, three. Oh, that looks so nice. Oh, I've, I've wanted stained glass for so long. Oh, especially in the Minecraft edition. Um, <clears throat> I just want to show you another thing they added. It's probably very cheaty. We'll just do this once, just for the purpose of showing you. 
they added a bunch of new sliders, including one that is absolutely incredible. Ah, daytime. I actually realized I just forgot to add a s screwed up a little bit there. <laughs> the settings are a little bit wonky. Ah, oh, there's one up here as well. Let's break this. X. Take your hand off the controller for one second to scratch your eyelid. Ugh, jump. Have you guys been playing the new Minecraft League? Let me know. Um, let me know in the comments section below. Tell me what your experiences have been with it. Do you like the new stuff that they added? I certainly do. Okay. <clears throat> So finicky. Alright. Yeah, we're definitely not going to have enough glass. Uh, do I need a cactus around here somewhere? I swear I did. <clears throat> Maybe it's in here. Two. That's not going to be enough. Alright, let's go break a cactus real quick. We have no shortage of cactus on this island. Cook up some more dye. And, um,. So we can fill out a house and get a nice look at what the green glass looks like on the way back. Ooh, that's nice. Nice, nice, nice. Really sort of goes well with the uh, dark of the uh, spruce uh, leaves. <coughs> oh. Brokey throat is bad today. Is this... Let's just, uh... Oh, can't cook up the doors, can I? Can't use doors to cook? Oh, that sucks. Alright, well... Let's just do a piece of coal. We're gonna have plenty of coal next episode. Alright, there we go. One, two, three. Side. Two, three. Place is looking lighter already. More fun. Which glass do we need here? Eight. 28 more glass panes. 24 more glass panes. Oh, <laughs> 25 more glass panes. And any second now. Watching glass cook. Any day. What do you guys think of uh, the building I've done so far? I, I, you know, I don't build a lot with sandstone. Uh, there are other better materials to use when I'm in creative mode, and I am just usually don't have this much sand available. I don't like playing in desert biomes when I'm playing survival, so uh, let me know what you think of the sandstone look. I quite like it. Um, I don't know if I'll use it all that often in uh, other series, but yeah, it's fun enough. <laughs> How much did I say? I need, I need 28. Sweet, there should be enough. Oh, definitely. Uh, no glass. Okay, right here. Break, break, break. Oh, they're noisy out, outside my room. Just don't know when to be quiet when I'm trying to record. Wow, that's interesting. <laughs> It looks like it's slime water. <laughs> ah, that might uh, make a good... Uh, doesn't really do it. Huh. Alright. Let's uh, go back to our normal view. Let's break the rest of these. Break, break, break. off into the ocean. Oh. Weird, you can't place it when you're standing that cool. Place it if you're standing too close. <clears throat> ah! Place! 
Thank you. News pickaxe might be quicker. So weird playing with no sound. I forgot to put my headphones on. Forest. Oh crap. Forest started recording. And I just swore, so I can't make this kid now. Um, I suppose that's as good a time as any, but uh, from now on, uh, you can tell what kind of, you know, age suitability my videos are uh, just by looking at the thumbnail uh, of the video in your YouTube player. If uh, the number of the episode is green, it's suitable for older people, if it's suitable for children, there's no swearing. Uh, if it's orange, there's some swearing. And if it's red, I highly suggest that you are 18 plus, but of course it's up to you and, you know, if you're under 18, your parents' decision. But yeah, that looks nice. I really do like that green. I thought I might hate it, but... Alright, last thing. We should probably actually have an axe first. Let's make an axe real quick. Got an axe to grind with you. <clears throat> ah, classic Minecraft crafting. <clears throat> oh, lost my voice there. Classic Minecraft crafting. God, I've missed it. You. And you. And this one. I don't think ladders look any different, so I won't need to replace the ladder. Eventually this chest will eventually get out of here too once I build off other crafting, not crafting, storage sections. These lights up quickly before it turns night time. Like spawns in here and blows this up. Yeah. Not on here. I do have to replace this balcony. Higher outside where there's a uh, fence post. Hopefully, I have enough on me. If not, I can always make some more. The recipe has changed, so hopefully, I remember. It has changed a little bit. Mm. I managed to get it the first time without uh, getting it wrong. And I made these originally, so. You what do you guys reckon? Do you reckon. Have you played with the craft, the classic crafting before? I personally much prefer it to the way that the Xbox did it originally. I get why they did it uh, from a coding perspective and from a user interface perspective, but um, still not very uh, effective. I didn't just didn't feel like, like it was Minecraft. Oh, that looks so much better already. Just that the, the dark colors goes so well with the light colors. It's all about contrast. Yeah. That's a big word for you guys. To look up. You already don't know. Try not to make this too kid friendly, too kid centered. I don't want my channel to become overly uh, aimed at children. But I do recognize that Minecraft is predominantly a you know children's game. I get that most adults, including myself, enjoy playing it. Quite a lot of you know older people who do enjoy playing it, but uh, a lot of kids do consume a lot of Minecraft regularly on YouTube. So uh, just uh, bear with me. Still finding my feet as a uh, as a YouTuber. Oh, we just had had just enough. All right, let's let's uh, back up and get a good look at this. Let's eat some oop, eat some raw flesh. Ugh. All sick. Oh, that looks so much nicer now. And I lit up the top of the house too, so uh, in case anybody was concerned about creepers falling off and blowing me up, I have lit up the top of the house. Sun is setting. We still don't have a bed. Um, This area is not lit up. Okay, for the purposes of this video, I am going to uh, wait until daytime, and uh, I'll be back as soon as I can. Alright, be right back, guys.
Hey guys and welcome back. I hope you uh, had a nice little break. For you it was a couple of seconds. For me it was a, uh, you know, a few minutes. Alright, so let's uh, let's get started on the second part of this episode. We're going to uh, have a look at our farms and we're going to get them started. Um, so just grab all this stuff here. Now, sweet. Okay, let's get started. Open up. Ding! Can't make a uh, coloured wood pressure plates just yet. A little, little annoying. Uh, so I'll show you this part down here first. This will eventually be the storage area for all my organic stuff. So saplings, some wood, and all this sort of stuff. Ores and stuff will get stored up here in my quarry. Uh, I'll have like a little building here for like my quarry and my mine. And we'll build that a little bit later on. Probably um, after we get the uh, beach resort started. Uh, finished, sorry, and maybe even after we start the Oasis. The Oasis is going to be a big deal, probably eight episodes maybe. It's probably going to be quite a long time, so we're going to split that up into uh, two or three episode bits, do one stuff in between. Um, so yeah, this is the stuff where I'll store everything from my farms, basically. Um, there's nothing yet, but uh, it's nice and it should be nice and lit up. I put the torches up there. You can't really see them unless you're looking up there. Sort of uh, keep the camera like this. You can't see, but it does look nicely lit. Um, I haven't had anything spawn down here yet, so hopefully it stays that way. I'm not entirely sure. Um, and yeah, so that's where we'll store that stuff. Uh, so let's just get planting. Let's get this sorted. Um, so I did create a grass section over here. It took me a long time. I had to create several grass bridges from the area down there that I showed you in the last episode. It's quite a long time to spread over to here, but I did eventually get it to here. Eventually I'll be using this as sort of like a dye farm. You plant blow, uh, bleh, bone meal here. Uh, you have a chance of growing flowers, hopefully, so I can get some red and yellow dye eventually. Um, and it's also just a good grassy area for if I manage to get any animals at all. I do have an idea, I might be able to get some mushrooms from the surrounding islands, bring them over here, shear them and turn them into normal cows. If so, then we could get books, and we can do enchanting, and that would, that would just be awesome. Um, so this section here I've set up for um, sugarcane. I just realized I actually need to come through here very shortly and put lighting up. Um, for sugarcane right here. Uh, this is the way I've got it set up works very well because sugarcane needs to be actually I just realized that won't work right there okay maybe I'm not so smart after all <laughs> I just damn bugger well yeah okay hmm well we'll plant it where we can <laughs> I have to maybe rethink the design of this Sugar canes will be planted near water. Maybe go crack. We can grow cactus there. But then, what's this? What am I going to plant here? I'll sort it out later. There might be a more efficient way. Besides, we don't need all that much of this. Pretty much, don't need sugar cane at all. Very, really much, and unless we get cows to make leather for books, we probably won't need much, if any sugar cane, but uh, it's probably a good idea to plant some anyway. Um, we'll be staggering cactus along here. It does have a chance to break, but we're not really, you know, we're not really hurting for too much cactus, but just in case, we want to be able to grow some cactus. Um, down here, this is our uh, tree farm, and I'm just going to sort of Spread them out a little bit, uh, not too much though. I'm gonna grow a bunch of different woods, um, but we're mostly gonna use spruce, so I'm gonna plant the most of the spruce. Plant a couple of jungle saplings down here. I'm just gonna try and make a tall one. Oh, it's all the saplings in here, actually. Well, that, that, that works out. Um, and then in this section here, uh, we're gonna grow carrots in this big section here, mostly because. Uh, carrots are more useful to me than wheat. Um, right, and if I get any potatoes from like killing a zombie or something, I'll also grow them here. So I'm going to plant these. Oh, nope, don't need that. Oh. 
smash. Okay. Yeah, we are going to grow wheat along these edges here. Just in case, you know, bread might help out times and you never know. Um, we could also eat wheat if uh, something ever happens to these carrots. It's always good to have a bunch of different foods. Um, yeah. That's my farms. You know, very simple, very basic. We're living a very basic... Oh god! That scared the crap out of me. And I just ruined my kid friendly. This definitely has to be an orange video. Well, <laughs> whew. Um, damn, that really scared me. Um, very basic farm. We do have simple living here out uh, on this little deserted island that we're on. Um, let's actually go put some of this stuff away down here. What that? Uh, saplings. We're probably going to get a lot of saplings, so the saplings in this chest down here. Remind me, guys, which chest I have it in. That's for sugar cane. Sugar cane can go right here as well. Excellent. And seeing as I have other food, I should actually be eating that. Save the rotten flesh for when we're truly out of food. We shouldn't. It shouldn't be long till we have sustainable food. I'll spend some time and actually uh, garden this section properly. Oh, it grew already. Holy! I can uh, shear those and uh, get some vines. We could use them for getting up and down the quarry uh, very quickly. So uh, let's just go make sure we've done everything we needed to. So two, the chest is empty. All right, excellent. Um, keep this chest and the sign. Never know when we're gonna need one of them. Eat mushroom stew very quickly and store that too. For the next episode, when I uh, go back over to check for the oh crap, the um. The treasure chest over there, I oh, will uh, fill up my stew things, I think. Because for the next episode, we're going mining. Uh, I discovered a little section down here. Well, this is. Before this was my quarry for sand and sandstone, I actually use this to get regular stone and dirt. And I discovered this down here. Look, an abandoned mine shaft. Oh, there's a skeleton there. Scary. Um, an abandoned mine shop, so hopefully uh, we'll go through there and we'll collect a bunch of cobwebs and stuff for string, maybe find some treasure chests, find some uh, some chests, and find some um, good ores and stuff. But I'm really hoping for a. Um... I just lost my train of thought. I'm really hoping for a spider spawn or a, yeah, even um, one of the poisonous spider spawners that uh, spawn in abandoned mine shafts because if we have a real, um, if we have that we can actually get a ton of string and make a ton of wool because this project down here this resort and bar um, just down here the beach section down here is going to use a lot up a lot of wool oh oh didn't turn off flying <laughs> oh damn <laughs> okay this section down here, we'll um, you know, use quite a bit of wool for carpets and shit. Fucker. Gotta stop swearing. Gotta stop swearing. Gotta stop swearing. Um, yeah, and uh, we will also... Um, we will be needing a bed, because like, even as right now, it's getting very dark. This might actually make a good thumbnail. Okay. I'll do it later. Anyway guys, uh, I think this brings us to the end. 30 minutes, pretty decent. Um, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, give us a little like down the bottom. If you've got any questions or comments, don't forget to leave them in the section below as well. And um, I'll do my best to answer any questions or any problems you have. Um, if you've got any tips for me for what I should be doing on this like, deserted island, if you think I'm doing something wrong with the, my design or you got some design tips for me, please don't feel afraid to put them in the comment section. Be nice about it though. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching and uh, I'll catch you on the next episode. Yes! Holy shit, did we do it?
Okay, they're our allies. Let's pull him back. Ow. Pull him back again and let's use our super against him. Ouch. Man, he is kicking our ass. He's a Templar if you didn't know. Oh yeah, now you're going down. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. 